What is up, YouTube? We're back with a weird little one here. Uh, I got a request. I got a request, and I'm happy to do this request. So the channel, shout out to the Frifting Lounge. The Frifting Lounge has uh, either nominated me or asked me. What? Anyway, Frifting Lounge got Froggy Clips to do one of his office, of his work area. So uh, Frifting Lounge asked me to do one of mine. Uh, I'm more than happy to do it and show you my workstation and what is in this uh, office, I guess, because everyone wants to see, or at least one person wants to see, so <laughs> let me take you on this tiny little tour. This should be quick, I guess. Let's do this. I know you want to see this. Let's do it. Come on. Let's do it now. So these are the lights I use uh, when I'm filming here in the uh, office. Um, I know there's a bit of a shining light on there. Don't even know what fucking brand this is, but these were about 150 bucks from uh, eBay. Good, nice LED lights. Uh, put the camera on here. This is my uh, office now. <laughs> it is very small. It is very small. I put this fold out table here in the middle only when I'm doing packaging. So when I'm doing packaging, I uh, put the fold out table there. So I'm gonna get rid of that right now. Cool, so that is gone. All right, so just in my computer room here, we'll start off by behind the door. So we'll close the door, a little bit of extra room for myself. There's the greatest movie of all time, the original uh, Charlton Heston, Planet of the Apes. That's not just a poster, that's a nice velvet poster, that one. Um, so this is some lotted up uh, videos I've got hidden over here. Um, this is garage sale stuff, so when I go to the markets, I am going to, and look, might as well utilize these lights. So I might as well utilize these lights while I'm doing this. There we go, utilize these lights. Okay, so this is kind of all garage sale stuff uh, right here. But then I've got up the top here, uh, just a little few motivational things, do what you love every day and all that. And then some old personal things like uh, my Pelican stuff and some wrestling stuff and all that. This is all stuff kind of for sale. Um, Space Crusaders I am gonna keep. I got the Nightmare and all that. And I've got all my DVDs, some videos. I separate them because I keep clamshells. Then I do small covers. And then over here, uh, more inventory stock and all that up here. Um, but then I have the big box cases and I have them alphabetically going down. Uh, DVDs that I've still got a lot up. Junk under the desk, of course. Junk under the desk. And then uh, this shelf as well, um, this is just the cardboard box covers. Uh, the cardboard box covers of the videos. Um, and then my own personal stuff up here, so some books and some Hulk Hogan's and all that. And then, of course, my Hasbro WWE uh, old 1991 figures in the best Royal Rumble of all time, 1992. And I've got my own stuff here as well that I uh, keep on display. Some Star Wars pops, some Ninja Turtles stuff. Uh, I was actually in the... the <laughs> Uh, yeah, I was in that anyway. I didn't get me. I, I lost the grand final. I was in the grand final. Um, that's another story. Freddy, and then my own He Man pops. I love that. And don't forget Kamal, because when we have a dog shit day, we are going to put Kamal on. So this is my own personal stuff. There's a dog shit there. I've got uh, that dog shit and uh, this dog shit. Good old Planet of the Apes. And some old games. I've got all the old uh, wrestling games. I keep all the old wrestling games. You'll spin out with these ones because I've got. Uh, what have we got? We moved Muhammad Ali out the way, got Simpsons Wrestling, WrestleMania the Arcade Games, Smackdown 2, these are old school, Warzone, Stone Cold, In Your House, WCW, Attitude, WCW again, old stuff there, stuff that I like to keep, Poison, stuff that I've uh, thrifted as well and then I've kept for myself. Oh man, if you've ever not tasted these Vegemite biscuits, these are the fucking bomb.com. So these are old personal stuff. I do um, keep a few fucking little things that I love up there, all my old little Nintendos, minis and all that. Uh, TV up here, I play video games on this as well, sometimes Nintendo. This is where I do my work. Um, this is where I do my editing and all that on the uh, Mac. Okay, if we move over to, I'll, I'll shine the lights over here. So if we move over to this area, there's a, that's what I usually put behind me, the Docker's pillow on the chair. Uh, this is just, uh, once again, these shelves, 
stuff for sale, Doctor Who's for sale there, and Care Bears and shit like that, and Ninja Turtles, and then I've got box sets of videos, kids, so I've categorized it kids, and there's all video games for sale. Um, that booty doll's got nothing on me. And we got uh, music, we got uh, blank media and sports, and then books down there. We got this fucking crate is kind of a death pile of uh, records. And then personal uh, pops there as well and Friday the 13th because I love Jason Voorhees. So, yeah, Phantom Butthole. Okay, I call this the Phantom Butthole Cupboard now. Because in the Phantom Butthole Cupboard, I've shown this on videos before. you you, you got to uh, keep yourself a little bit uh, motivated. Let's get the light in here to make it look a bit better. All right. So, remind yourself when you open your cupboard, you want money. And, uh, you know, but get a whiteboard. Get a whiteboard, cut it out, put some permanent writing on there with permanent texture, and write on here every time you take your postage things. You write on there with the, your whiteboard marker, which my whiteboard marker is missing, so I haven't written on there, but I know I've got 43, I think, of them. So 43 needs to be written there. I've got no one kilo ones left, no three kilo ones left, one five kilo bag left, uh, DVD, pose. Uh, and, uh, see, I've got all the things like lucky bands, thank you things, and bubble wrap. If I need it, I'll fucking put a little thing there saying I need it. Um, yeah. And then all other, all other dog shit crap in there as well and junk. But that's the way I, that's the way I do my stuff and motivational. It's really cool, so you can keep an eye on there. So get a whiteboard um, marker and just sticky tape it up there and cut it out, right in permanent marker, and then you can uh, let yourself know how many uh, things you got left. I just can't find my whiteboard marker, that's, but I know where all uh, my stuff is. And just up here, uh, I've got my own. Per I got to move this. I got to move these fucking stupid angry. I got to move this dumb care bear. Oh no! All right. I had to move that dumb care bear. You've got to see the Hulk Hogan collection. Or the Hulk Hogan collection on the wall there. You wanted to see my office? You now see my office. There's all the Hulk Hogan ones. I can get some good money for them, but I'm not gonna. There's the Ultimate Warrior, my Ultimate Warrior collection. There's one with Papa Shango. Good Warrior one, that one. Some good Warrior stuff there. I love that one. That was the 1991 Royal Rumble. That one there is fucking nice as well with the blue belt. That's pretty cool. And it is a it is a very small room. Over here is um, all the boxes of in inventory as well. Oh, and don't forget about the uh, umbrella in the skylight. <laughs> so no air comes in here. It's pretty fucking horrible. I built this fucking I built this thing out of pallets. I'll show you this in a minute. So anyway, I got shoes, shoes there. I got misc, plush. Loose toys, my toys, new toys, bed sheets, TV series, box sets, death pile. Oh, you don't want to know about that. The part that sucks when you when you sell something and you've got to fucking take box down by box down. But I've seen more people have more shit than me, so it's not a big deal. She's fucking vacuuming. Every fucking time. Get the fucking vacuum now. The vacuum's annoying, mate. All right, so this box, I made this box. This box, anyone can make one of these. Um, I sanded it, I got a pallets. You know the pallets, when they can get free pallets side of the road. I, grab, I broke down a whole heap of pallets, sanded them down, gave them a varnish, built a fucking box. And I built this fucking uh, big chest. On wheels. On wheels. So in here is just everything. I've got everything from Kiss to Planet of the Apes, Jason Voorhees, old Star Wars shit, and this is my old own personal stuff. There's Pinhead, got heaps of turtle shit in here. Uh, I guess you don't really want to see all this stuff because you just wanted to see my office, but I thought I'd show you what's in the box with the dots. These turtles are fucking cool. They're nice, they're nice figures, those ones. Got heaps of stuff down here. 
Heaps of turtles. Nice Freddy Krueger there. Ah, oh, god damn it! Balls on your face. So some unusual stuff. Some unusual stuff, but heaps of turtle shit and collecting stuff. I'm not going to dig all the way down, but uh, you can imagine. You can imagine. So that moves easy. That moves easy. Uh, just in here, just more stock. All these fucking mannequin heads I uh, ordered a long time ago, don't ask me why. And then some other warrior stuff, I gotta put him on the wall. Bits and pieces, nothing uh, special in here. NXT Live that I went to with me ticket. And always keep a motivational board for yourself because whenever you feel down, uh, I know it sounds lame, but uh, sometimes you like to just look up and just look up and, uh, you know, have a read of some different things and put something up every week, you know? Like, you know, judge me when you're perfect. Who the fuck are you to fucking judge me? And that's the way I look at it. Who the fuck do you think you are judging me? If you don't like this video, fucking get out of it. Get the fuck out of it. And today I refuse to stress myself about things I cannot fucking change. I can't fucking change if you don't like it. If you don't like this office. If you don't like the phantom butthole. It's not my fault if you don't like the phantom butthole. I refuse to stress about things that I cannot change. So, that is the office. That might have been a little bit too long. But let me quickly show you the area where I take photos. Yes. Okay, so in the front room of the house here, I've moved the LED lights in here. You would have seen on another video when we're taking photos of a uh, shirt. We had them hung up on this big fucker here. This is where I take my photos of my jeans. I just fucking made this little hanger thing and I hang off this frame. So this is just like one of those green screen frames. You get the black, you get the white, and you get the green uh, backdrop. Simple to put up, takes five minutes. I think it cost me 50 or 60 bucks to buy, nothing at all really. Uh, it's your basic frame. That's where I hang my jeans. Over here, look at this, look how good this is. We invented this to hang the shirts on. This is where we take a photo of the shirts. Everyone does it differently, so if you don't like my way, whatever. But we take photos here of the shirts on this steam cleaning machine. That's right put it on this steam cleaning machine. So when you take photos of this, you don't see the plug, don't see anything else, you just get the shirt, it looks good. This, this right here, all it is is a fucking steam cleaning machine. So that's where we take photos of shirts. And then over here is for DVDs and videos. This is just a soft box. Just a soft box. Use your LED lights again. Bring them over, you can put them to the side like that. I like to put them in the front there. And just chuck your video in, DVD, take photos in there with the black background. Simple as that, easy. That was 50 bucks, you get three different backgrounds. 50 bucks as well. Utilize whatever you got to do your shirts. And there's my lights, which were about 150, 100 bucks. Happy as a pig and shit. And basically, that's it. That's what you wanted to see. I've shown you in my office. I've shown you where I work. It's hot. Now you know why it's hot in here, because I have no airflow, uh, no fan or anything. I've just got a fucking umbrella over a light. This is where I'm doing my editing. This is where I work and uh, list and, of course, we list on the couch and all that shit as well. But this is my office. That's what you wanted to see, my office. All right. Part of me, an inkling of me, is saying nominate someone. Nominate someone to see their office, to see their work area, to see where they take photos and all that shit. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to nominate everyone. I'm going to nominate everyone this week. You all have one week. You all have one week. It doesn't take long to quickly tour your, do a tour of your uh, office. 
and your workstations and all that. So I was nominated. Now I'm nominating everyone. I want everyone to do a tour. Tour of your office. Everyone try and name your video exactly the same. And don't let the dog bark in your videos. So there we go guys. Do that. I want to see everyone else's offices now because you've seen mine and you've seen all my collected junk and all that. Uh, grab a pallet and make a fucking box. Cost you fuck all. Cost you varnish. Cost you varnish. Someone will have tools to... Someone will have tools to do sanding and cutting and shit. You saw how bad all my cutting was there. Nothing's, nothing's by measurement. It's all out of whack. So, make yourself a toolbox there. Put it on wheels. Cost you fuck all. And it's free pallets on the side of the road. There you go for storage. Anyway, I'm out of here. I just did this one as a quick, uh, just a quick little video. Hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe. Do what the fuck you want. But if you liked the shit that I had, maybe give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, I don't know why you watched until now, but uh, thanks for staying around, alright? Anyway, I'm out of here. My balls are all fucking sweaty. See you!